Hi, Mark. Good day. Well, up from the big smoke, eh? I'm Neil Clark. Steve. Oh, and this is Tamara, my sister. Good day. Hi, Tam. Well, you both settled in then? So, your cowboy's dead? Yeah, for my sins. <laughs> is he here? Oh, he's over there somewhere. Take a look if you like. Ta. Steve? No, hang around here for a minute. Okay. Well, come on, I'll uh, show you around. How are things on the home front? Oh, the greenies? Oh, they're all right. Nice bunch. They're uh, clean and they're quiet. You don't know what their plan of action is, do you, Neil? Well, you're not looking for a spy, are you, Mike? Don't want me to light a lantern when the march starts. <laughs> no, 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 I just like to be forewarned. Oh, I don't think they're going to give any trouble. They're concerned about the destruction of the rainforest. Good on them. Is that right? Will it be ruined? Well, I'll tell you something, son. They're chopping them down quicker than they can grow. And in my books, there's too much destruction and not enough people giving a hoot about the future. How many cattle you got? Oh, it's mainly dairy herd. 80 milking and about 20 head of beef. It must be great working outdoors. Reckon you'd like it, do you? No, I would. Oh, why don't you put your money where your mouth is and uh, come up here before school and earn your keep? Are you offering me a job? Well, it looks that way. Well, uh, my son is more than useless. Reckons it's demoralising working up here with a pack of girls. I think you could handle it for a city slicker. I'd love it. It's hard yakka. I can't pay you much. When do I start? What about tomorrow morning? Five o'clock. Great. That all right with you, Mike? If he thinks he can do it, good on him. All right. He's doing pretty good, Mike. You were right, he's a real good worker. Yeah, well, it must run in the family. <laughs> Excuse me, Glenn. Sorry to interrupt, Mike, but there seems to be some trouble outside. Well, what sort of trouble? I think you better go and have a look. Excuse me for a minute, Glenn. I'm like that. Oh, if I must. I'll look after her. Don't you worry. May I buy the charming lady a drink? Oh, now, how could I possibly refuse an offer like that? Mr. Clark. Yeah, well, I didn't ask him. Oh, no, why should you? You're only his father. Well, why didn't you? You're his mother. I'm not going to argue. Good. Good. G'day. Hi. G'day. Uh, have either of you two seen Cowboy? Well, not since yesterday. Isn't he camping out? Well, he was camping out, but his mother expected him home last night. Now, you make sure that he gets it. Yes, sir. All right. The cows come first. Oh, that's really... 